Hey everybody, it's Mr. Shishimon. I'm back again with Spectrobe's Origins. And in this episode, well, one, we're supposed to get our sixth Spect- or our, well, pretty much getting our last Spectro for Camtoga. And, um, I already know who I wanted to be for this one, and we have the fossil for it already. The Ukabi fossil. Now, it's a water one, but it's a bit weird. It is my other, like, super high level guy, so I'm not going to be using him right off the bat like normal. But, it's a little floaty. Ukabi. Uh, I am going to just name him Ukabi, because I don't know what else to name him. Ukabi. Confirm! Yes! Yes. And I'm going to evolve Ukabi. Because... This is who I wanted on my last team member. And, uh... It's magnificent. Let us enter the incubator. Alrighty. I should have a bunch of, um... Fossils already- or not fossils, evolution stones, because I just collect them. Even if you don't need them for a while, you should still collect a bunch of them. I still need a bunch more than that. Hi, Ukabi. Hey, get over here. Eat it. Eat it! Eat a dick and other romantic poetry. Let's do this! Evolve! And he's like a giant serpent thing. Yeah. He's got this Egyptian thing going on, and I like it. I think it's Final Evolution. He's supposed to look like a freaking boat. But, um... I don't remember fully. Oh yeah, I got another water guy. Late, uh, last, er... Earlier? I need another, I need another air guy, though. I've only really gotten one, and that was smart. <laughs> Zappy. Alright, we have a full team like we are supposed to have. I should be on Mayo, but whatever. Now we're supposed to go talk to Cam Toga. Considering we have a full inventory of Spectrobes. For now. Wrong way. I can almost never remember which direction is uh, the ship right off the bat, and which direction is the exit. Okay, I mean we're in the ship. Whatever, cockpit. Whatever. Cam Toga is over here. It just reminds me of Christmas here. And, uh, the lack of winter clothing is amazing, especially on Gina. I can accept Rollin, because I'm sure his thing has, like, you know, I'm sure his outfit has, like, temperature control, but Gina is, like, has a midriff. Like, really? Aw, <laughs> oh, you're back! Did you get all the spectrums like I told you? Let's see here. Yep, the, all the Cosmo Link slots are filled. Nice job. You're more than qualified to be the new Spectrum Master of the Kaio system. This is for you. Go, a go ahead. You'll definitely earn it. We got a Cosma key. <gasps> oh, I think this is what we needed. Thanks, but what is it? Why, that's the one and only Cosma key. It's proof that you're a true Spectro Master. Each generation of Spectro Masters here in the Kaio system carries it, including that former partner of mine. Then it must be a one of how your treasured keepsakes. How could we possibly accept it? Don't be ridiculous. The Cosmo Key belongs to the ha in the hands of the Spectro Master, plain and simple. I think you two are more than fit the bill. Ah, oh, thanks, Kemtoga. I'll carry it and proudly make sure it I t to take good care of it. God damn. Yeah. See, th see that you do. Oh, and by the way, it also gives you it gives its rightful bearer a new power. A new power. That's right. You ever see those ancient stone markers scattered around the Kaio system? Well, it's sealed within those are legendary weapons that only Spectro Masters can wield. Legendary weapons? That sound I like the sound of that! Hey, let me finish. It's the Cosmo Link that will allow you to get the weapon. The Crawl are only getting stronger, so you better go get the legendary weapon or two... Or, 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 uh, get a legendary weapon or two before you go into the ruins. But you gotta find a stone marker first! I'd get started right now if I were you. Once you got a legendary weapon in your hand, I'll tell you where the ice ruins are. Okay, so, I tried doing this earlier, and it didn't really work so well for me. But there's a couple things I want to do. I'm not going to progress in this episode, 
Why not, you might ask? First of all, which place is it? Uh, Sanctum Ruins, Fossil Spectra, Power Fighter, Golden Yellow Body, Fire Property. Uh, there's a wind one I'm trying to find. It's water. Dawn Bridge. You know, the double co op attack. Ah, I know who that is. Sunny Grasslands. Uh, put under the massive tree, said there's powerful sky is channeled in here. Okay. So I'm gonna head back to Watera. Uh, since we got a little bit of off track, or sidetracking to do. And, uh, this is the perfect time to start doing this. But first I gotta go get, uh, air properties. Ah, Spectra. I mean, there's a bunch of properties I need to have. So let's go to Watera. And I want to go to Watera, and I'm eventually gonna go to... Alright, here's Watera. I'm eventually gonna go to, um... Doldogo, too. Because I want to clear out everything we gotta do here. Right now I have grass, fire, and rock. Uh... Uh... Searching spectrums first. And, um... I gotta use these guys. Or plant rocket. But I gotta go to Sunny Grasslands as well. But anyway, uh, I'm gonna head through and I already opened the door for you, so I'm gonna use you. I love the sounds of that. Uh, there's an air one over there, but I don't have the air. I need to go to Sunny Grasslands for that. It's under the big tree for a mystery pod. And I'm gonna be looking for a bunch of mystery pods, that's for sure. Now, it's going to be a longer episode because I'm doing some things like hunting items and stuff. Oh, what are you, Inception Hill? What's up with Inception Hill? Stone markers? Okay, you're just helping out. Yeah, okay, you're just helping out. Alright, let's go click clacking away. I don't think there's one at the excavation site, but I'm going to check just to be sure. Ah, uh, stone markers... Oh, there's one. Okay, cool. There's an earth one by the excavation site. All right, cool. They actually do help. All right. We're gonna find it. Let's see, where is it? Ah, there you are. Yeah, there was one over here. Okay. Go. Let's do this. You got this! My little shoes. They're literally shoes. And yes, I am going to be showing off every weapon as I get them. Like I said, these are going to be a little bit of longer episodes, but they got some important stuff to deal with. And the, finally, the keystones are glowing like they should be. Alrighty. Oh, it's beautiful! The Buto Swords. It's a legendary weapon. Kantoba said they contain the power of the evolved form of Spectrobes. The ancient Spectro masters must have left this marker here for people like us. Yeah, they must have foreseen the future generations would someday face the same crisis they did. Wow, I guess we're the first to wield this weapon since ancient times. Those crawler in for it now. It's now our turn to protect the Kyo system, just like the ancient Spectro masters back in their time. Let's go tell Kamtoga that we found a new weapon. Okay. Yeah, I could do that right now. Or I could show off all my new weapons that I get. And this is not my favorite weapon, I promise you. My favorite weapon is later. Oh, yeah, I got a blaster. I need to show the blaster off, too, because I didn't have a chance to do that earlier. But we'll start with the Buto Swords. Oh, the Buto Sword. I say swords because it's a it's a pair of two, technically. And, uh, there's some dark... Ah, there's, oh, there's a dark mineral Go. over there. Grab it. Alright, we got these ass hats. Alright, let's change the Mayo just in case. Oh, it's, just a, it's basically just a sword. Oh yeah, but they all have different kinds of uh, hacking. And this one, I don't think it hits. No, it do, it um does double the amount of damage. I mean, technically, we're using a spectro. Power is a dual like uh, a dual spectro. But I like this guy just the same. Or I like this weapon just the same. I'm gonna 
gonna change to the blaster just because this is the last guy and I should be using the cosmic blaster right now just to show it off. I don't usually use blasters, so even though I'm showing them off, I'm not gonna be like a staple to use it. It's just literally fire to your heart's content. And you win. Like I said, not a big fan of blasters, but they'll do. I'll head out. And I gotta go pick up a Spectro for this area, so... Other than, um... Like... You know... Most of the time I think I'll beat a planet before I go and collect all their stuff. Personally, but... That's just me. I think that's what I'm gonna do. So, like, the planets I have completed, like this planet, and, uh... Blah, blah. Yeah, these guys just help you out and tell you which ones are which. Um, like, I think I'm gonna, like, completely, yeah, like I was saying, I think I'm gonna completely beat a planet before I, uh, go ahead and, uh, collect all of the stone tablets from them, like, collect all the weapons, the legendary weapons from them, just because it's easier to do, and it doesn't really break up the story that much. Uh, the only reason I'm doing these two as I am right now is because I have a break in the action. He asked me to go grab them, and I'm going to do so. I already opened this one, so I can just walk right in willy-nilly. If you look at that. So, what do you have for me? I think you have the... I think I know which one this one is. I think they're all based off the spectrums that are on the planet. Yeah! Mm-hmm. Mmm, it's the Zaza Sword. Is it the same thing? Got a new weapon. Can't wait to try it out. Yep, that's pretty much all to say. Speaking of try it out. Also, if you haven't noticed... Oh my god, it's a new sword. I love it. If you haven't noticed, on the uh, armband, or on the wrist, or whatever it is, like the forearm, uh, it actually changes to that weapon thing when you equipped a weapon, which I think is actually really neat. I like that, a little detail about it. I usually keep the, uh... Co I usually kept the Cosmos Sword around for the most part. Is that, is that, that looks Go. like a Dark Mineral. Yep, yep it is. Alright, let's test out this new sword, this Fire Sword. Get him. It does pretty good solid damage. Anyway, sorry about this. I just saw the opportunity and I'm taking it. Yeah. It's a cool sword, and I love that it just explodes in fire. It's really fun. Not gonna lie. And I'm not gonna also I'm not gonna lie that I'm probably gonna be using a sword that uh is from the area. Or like I'm probably gonna, I'm like I say, I'm gonna be using swords most of the time. And in the thing of using swords most of the time. I'm just gonna be switching around to different properties of swords that exit that uh, are better to the or uh, better to fight the crawl in certain areas. Like here it really doesn't matter, but if I'm on a like a place where there's grass spectrums, I'm gonna use a fire sword. If there's a place of It's just gonna be me using swords. I like axes and all, but they're just I'm, I'm just bad with them. That's all. Just really bad with axes. Um, there should be one here. I know that. But I'm also looking for a Spectro that lives in this Go. area. I read the, uh, like I... should be, like, a grass Spectro near this tree. Or not a grass, a wind one. And I know which one it is. But I don't remember exactly where it's at. Or how to get it. Go! Okay, it's a green mineral. Oh, what's this? That looks like a spot. No? Okay. Uh, I need to find an air one, just because that's... Go! No, 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 do not pick that up, buddy. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, leave it fast. Go! Okay. Ooh, I left it fast enough. Go! Sometimes if you leave the uh, dark minerals fast enough, I need items. That's a good thing. What's this direction, I wonder? Can I do this right now? I don't think I can do this right now. Doesn't look like it. Looks like this is as far as we can go. Maybe start thinking we're onto something. Come on, Gina, pull some magic out of your hat. I thought you could do anything. Never said that. We'll just have to wait and figure out a way to get across. Okay. 
That is later. That is something for later. So, um, yeah, there's a air spectrum in this area I need to find. Is that a mystery pod? If that's a mystery pod, I'm on to something. It is a mystery pod. Cool. I, oh, I almost did that one. Okay, I know there's... I'm trying to look for the, uh... Keystone here. Oh, there it is! It's the grass one over here. That's cool. Found it. Go. Go. I'm trying to send you over there. There you go. Did you figure it out yet? Ah, there it is. I actually do need to head back to go grab a water and a wind one. I hope this mystery pod is the wind one. Because if it's not, that'd be... Ahead. I think I found a grass guy on this planet. Or not? I don't know. No, but we know who this is! Yep! And this is an axe! Oh, it's the spiking axe! Oh, this is beautiful! I, like I say, I'm not the biggest fan on axes, but. Oh my god, it is gorgeous. It's an axe, and it's made from spiking. I can deal. Oh man, where is a where's the thing? Where's the thing? Where is the thing? Where is it? I thought I saw one nearby. Ah, is that a purple? Yep, that's a purple. Go. I'll grab it, bitch. Well, you know what? I'm actually on training spiking right now, so you know. This thing is beautiful. But like I say, it is a freaking slow ass. This is my most powerful weapon so far. Like, this thing does so much freaking damage. Whoa, let's get this shot. Oh, let's do this. Just because he is hurt. But yeah, this thing does a massive amount of damage. Oh my goodness, Spike, and you leveled up. Thank God. Yeah, this is a strong-ass weapon, but it's still really fucking slow. And I can check my thing right here, actually. Which is nice that I have a save point in the middle and do a bunch of lab stuff. Lab. Lab stuff. Please be the guy I'm looking for. Because I need wind. I need it really badly. Because I'm just going to, like, switch out and head back into this. Oh, this isn't the right guy. Uh, it's the fire one. It's the Zaza pod. But we do need it anyway, so I'm going to... Ow, shit. going to excavate it. Uh, I'm probably going to speed up until I get the uh, guy... Ah, shit. Until I get the guy I'm looking for. So, yeah. Speeding up. Now. I'm back. And you don't want to know how long it took to find that freaking wind spectrobe. Well, you probably do. That took over, over an hour to find that thing. And it was a pain in the ass. But I found it. And now I can finish this episode. Uh, I finally have a wind spectrobe to do a bunch of this stuff with now, at least. At least there's that. I can see over here... Go. I also found a bunch of the, um, I found a bunch of the, of the ways to get these, to get these weapons. That was interesting. Oh yeah, you haven't seen him because, uh, I got this guy off screen. He's literally a swordfish. Literally. And it's lovely. Get this. Oh, yeah, I don't have this guy. Oh, what is this? It's a lance. No, it is a lance. It's a Zenny lance. There's another guy called Zenny. It's a water turtle. Ew. Well, I better show it anyway. Did I hit equipment or did I hit lineup? Oh, okay, hit equipment. It's a water lance. And I hate this thing. I don't know, it's just a lance, so I hate it. Fair? Alright, let's see here. I thought I, I saw a purple or a. Uh, there's a dark one. Go grab it, buddy. Go grab it. Alrighty. Oh, this 
not good. But I do have fire, so this is bad. Especially for me using a lance. Especially me using a water lance. It's just a water lance! And it's awful! It's just awful! That's all. Cut through that guy. Holy crap. Over there. Yeah. 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 Now. Yeah. yeah, this is a terrible weapon. Yeah. Over there. I hate Lance. Yeah. At least they do like continue, yeah. not really continuous yeah. damage, but like yeah. damage over time, I guess. Ugh, it's so gross. I hate it. I can switch to my little sheep, which I aptly nicknamed him. Oh my god, he runs adorably. Now, this sheep. The weapon that you get here is based off of the sheep. And man, once you get it, you'll see. It is my favorite weapon in the entire game so far. I might have another one that breaks, that beats it, but I'm not sure yet. Because... Oh boy. You'll see what I mean by this weapon being my favorite weapon. Man, it is nice. It is real nice. Alright, let's go to Don Bridge. Or at least try to get back to uh Inception Hill. And uh yeah. I should be getting the last weapon here. I think it's the last weapon. It should be the last weapon. I mean, there's a place we cannot go right now, so there might be a weapon there that I missed, but... As long as it's the last weapon we can get to. I know there's one in, um... Doldogo that we can't get right now. Because I went to all the other different planets to try to get this fucking sheep. <laughs> I'm sorry, this sheep took me forever, and I am mad at it for how long it took me to freaking get. Ugh. Alrighty. Let's head back to Inception Hill. As long as, as, long as we walk our way downtown, having a blast, all an ass is pulled out. Da 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 da. I want this weapon! Other planets! Ah. Alrighty. Let's get to Inception Hill, because I know it's exactly where I want to be. It's the weapon I want. Like, you have no idea the weapon that I crave for is here. Oh, man. Go! It's based off this little sheep. Let's do this. It, this thing is adorable, but it's freaking evil to find. I found it so much quicker on earlier playthroughs. Like, it's not even funny. The stupid Let's Play curse has gotten to me. It's weird how the wind ones aren't yellow, but they're like... pink. I don't know. There it is! Oh man! The Yagi Sword! Oh, do I love it so much! Okay. I I would play I've played through this game with just the Yagi Sword. Because I love the Yagi Sword so much. And there is only one reason why I like this Yagi Sword. One reason. Now, where is it? Where is a, um... There it is. There's a dark... Dark mineral. Go grab it, buddy. Because every time you swing, it has a trail of rainbows. That's the only reason I like the Yagi Sword. It's not even that powerful. But it's like, it's got a very, very high, uh, combo yield. It freaking trails rainbows. And it's good on the planet we're on right now, because it's actually strong against the water spectrum. Oh wait, hey. Switch this anyway. Yeah, 
You're gonna see me use the sword a lot. But anyway. Oh man, this episode was longer than I expected it to be. This is all the time I have for this episode. Next episode, we're going to be going... Uh, we're going to be going... We're going to get all of the weapons we can get on Dol Dogo. This is gonna be Mr. Shishimo, signing off.